Hey everybody, Spider Dan's Web here. Uh, it's been a long but fun day. I uh, just left the Toronto Expo. I'm not even in the uh, International Center's parking lot. I'm in the Go parking lot. That's how busy it was today on Saturday. So word of the wise, come on a Friday, um, not on a Saturday. But um, yeah, I already had no money and now I definitely don't. Uh, but uh, by supporting my midlife crisis, I think I'm good for the year, if not longer. Found some crazy deals in there. Uh, picked up a couple Charizard EX boxes. Plan to keep one sealed. Um, the least damaged one. And we'll open up another one on a break. So stay tuned for that. Uh, picked up just some little odds and ends. You know, oversized card, $2. Booster bundle, $25. Paradox Rift. You know, that's already like a $40 savings for some of these vendors or whatever. Got a lot of cool singles uh, for cards that I needed for sets. Uh, just random stuff because it's very, like I said, a lot of people. Mike Tyson was there today uh, and it was very busy. Um, so I just tried getting what I can, meeting who I know, just seeing around, talking to people. It was a really good time. And I also graded um, five cards from my, sorry, six cards from my Gym Heroes First Edition and five uh, up future cards uh, from through Mint. So with five, six through PSA, five through Mint. So within the next uh, half a year, stay tuned for those when I get those back. Got two more uh, slabs from Quiet Customs that I could put my cards in. Uh, and a cool PSA 9 slab that I saw Vente, uh, Hidden F Shining Fates GX. About to add that to my collection. But for now, we're going to open four packs of Brilliant Stars that I got for $4 each, if you could believe that. So... Uh, definitely bang for your buck. No Evolving Skies was not on the list of cheap cards. Ooh, this one's got a little damage to it. Let's hope. Uh, but, uh, yeah. You're going to do a quick card break right here. And then we're going to have a little bit more content to break uh, at home. I'll do the six-pack booster of uh, Paradox Rift and one of the Charizard boxes at least. Uh, among the other stuff that's going to come out. So, thank you all. I'm really tired, really hot. going to head home to my family the rest of the for the night <laughs> but it was fun i'm glad i got out and did something for myself uh, it's been too long so anyways four brilliant stars packs let's go psychic energy i'm gonna move in a little bit here probo pass gino oh my card's are already sliding off here Dedene. nose pass snow runt nope not yet i got double on that reverse mag mortar and a riot uv Okay, cool. Got a hit on the first pack. I think it's a card that I need as well. Code card there. That's garbage. Second pack. Brilliant stars. They had like fusion strike stars, go. I was tempted to get go. I know I used to get go all the time, but I said to myself, no, you know what? You always go, go and get go. And you only need um, like maybe 20 cards left. So bang for my buck. Still trying to go for some of the pulls for this. V star. Okay, Magma Basin, Crawdunt, whatever that was, Scarablast, Mingino, Turtwig, favorite Gen 4 starter, Piplup, second favorite Gen 4 starter, Shroomish, Reverse Luxray, and a Wormadam non-hollow rare. Okay, one hit so far, halfway to go. Oh, I'm most excited for the graded cards. It, it feels kind of weird that I've left cards that are really dear to me. They're gone. Um, uh, oh yeah, code cards. Sorry, code card there. Ah, code card there. But uh, yeah, that's how it goes. Uh, Mint should be uh, be back by the next uh, card show, which might actually be in two weeks. Uh, so if I go to the Kitchener card show, um, I can get them back. If not, I can get them delivered uh, for a fee. Uh, so. But PSA is the one that's like 120 day. <laughs> it said 65 on the form. And the guy wrote 120. Reverse Golet into a Torterra Hollow. So, man, I should have mixed these up. I should have grabbed from the front and the back. Lucky I got there. It was four. It was four. No, actually, no. That's, that's a lie. Sorry. Brain's not working. There was only four Brilliant Stars packs left. And the guy next to me bought like 30 or 40 packs of stuff. Uh, go card. It was wild. It was just wild. 
because they were just this place was selling them for cheap and you know what i finally did it you barter a bit you make some deals you make good deals right i probably saved at least 30 dollars in just saying hey bundle this with this and get that right so it's all about your value uh black friday's coming up but i would definitely pay the uh, fee to get in here uh next year and just grab a bunch of cards for the year reverse roseanne's backup and no alchemy non-hollow no big hits other than the Riot 2 V on this one. But like I said, got some other cool pulls. Inteleon, VMAX, and then, well, you're going to see the prices on these, but oh well. Uh, the Mew from Celebrations, a Weird Ear, a Meowth promo from one of the first promos. It's number four in the Sword and Shield era. Um, like I said, the great uh, Quiet Customs. Uh, I have the card for this I'm going to open because I don't think it's gradable. And also the card I got for the Charizard. You'll see that on the break I got from 204. Met the gang at 204 breaks. Really nice. Uh, Paradox Rift will be a break I do. And yeah, did walk away with at least one slab today. So um, all in all, it was a lot of fun. Met some cool people. And um, yeah, uh, hope to see more breaks. And thank you everyone for the support. And also too... Just a shout out to everyone for Remembrance Day. I uh, hope you just took some time to think about all those that sacrificed for this country. I know I have family that uh, was involved in that. So just while I'm enjoying the nice things in life, just a shout out in a moment uh, to think about all them. So hope everyone has a great weekend. Stay inside or stay, stay warm. And if you're not, have fun and stay safe. Thanks.